Alright, hello everybody and welcome to the channel. As usual, my name is of course Constantine and today in the world of video games, I'm just about to introduce you guys to a really special game. This one is called Jusson and I think I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, it is French for downstream, I think if I'm not mistaken. And this is going to be all about climbing. It is a very, very special game. I really enjoy what I've seen on Xbox Showcase um, and I gotta tell y'all, I'm super excited about this game. So without further ado guys, uh, I'm just going to jump into this one real fast. Keep in mind, this is the demo version. The game is going to be coming out this fall. 2023 so i'm super excited about that one and as usual if you're as excited as i am make sure you leave a like that helps the channel super much and let's just dive right in song french maritime turn qualifying a period of low ocean tide ah, i knew it so song means downstream i guess or i think it's called um egg tide or something like that ebb tide Look at this game. Again, as I was saying, guys, keep in mind, uh, this is just a demo version, so we might encounter some issues here and there on the game. Um, hopefully nothing too bad. But yeah, just in case you're going to see something funny happening at the game, that's just because this is a demo version. It's not a full release, the final release. The reason I'm trying to play this game and show you guys some of these awesome demos is because I want you guys to kind of see what is coming very, very soon in terms of really beautiful games and of course if you're enjoying what you see you can always go ahead and wishlist the game add it to your wishlist and purchase it uh once the game comes out but this is already looking super spectacular i'm currently playing this one on a pc uh on max settings and uh, i'm loving what i'm seeing I think we're just about to climb this really huge mountain. Chisson? I'm loving the name. Really, really loving the name. It has such a really interesting sound to it. <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> it it kind of looks like a traditional crab in the real world, but uh, it is definitely a little bit different. Man, this is such a pretty game. Now, I don't know how long the demo is going to be. Hopefully not too short. I have a feeling I'm about to climb all the way to that tower that I'm looking at right now. And probably that's where the uh, demo is going to end. I don't know, but uh, let's just see. Apparently, we just entered the gameplay, and this... Oh, man, this looks so spectacular. Chapter 1. Daymark. Oh, are you kidding me? Man, I'm so happy that this game is actually coming out this year. Wait, I already made my way all the way up to the top here. Seriously, from all the way down there. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Uh, the camera is kind of like moving a little bit weirdly, unfortunately. But again, don't forget, as I was saying, this is just a demo. A lot of things are going to be improved. Uh, I think I'm just about to keep on climbing. So the game is about climbing, exploring really beautiful worlds. And I think this is going to be the main mechanic, right, of climbing. Aha, uh, uh -huh. so you're holding on to L to attach. Or actually, I'm holding LT, RT to hold grip. Ah, uh, what? No way. So... With LT and RT, I'm actually using left hand and right hand in order to grip, of course. That is so epic. So epic indeed. Alright, next up, we gotta disconnect, I guess, that one. And connect ourselves to the next one. 
Mm hmm. That is so cool. So cool indeed. I'm loving this so far. Absolutely loving this. Uh, hole B, let's wind the rope. Uh, so you're gonna have like a, a limited number of ropes, of course, that you can use. I get it. That is super cool. This is such a unique game though. Such a unique game indeed. Uh, there seems to be already rope in here. These, uh, carab these carabiners are medically secure the climb. Ah. Okay. Perfect. And grab that back again. And I think we gotta climb through here. I love that you're automatically connecting that thing. You don't have to do it uh, manually all the time. As soon as you start climbing, it does its job. Man, this feels so good. The game does feel a little bit choppy, though. We're on the ground. Wind the rope. Uh, the game does feel a little bit choppy, or maybe the camera is just choppy, I'm not quite sure. It may also be the fact that I'm using uh, high-quality settings. The three small icons represent secondary pythons. Pythons? pythons? <laughs> if they're full, I guess uh, you cannot go any further. Hold X to place a python. Ah, so that's how you do it, I get it. So you gotta place a few of these. Uh, of course, you can also grab it back. Hold up, let me go back here. Okay. Hold to load a jump. Ah, so you can load a jump. Wait, what? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me do that again. So let me first of all place a python over here and jump. Oh god, what? Ooh, almost fell down. That was awesome. I gotta make sure I use the proper buttons, of course, to catch. That is so cool. Is this stamina? Okay, okay, so this is gonna be the stamina. Probably the strength of my hold. The right hand guard represents your stamina. Monitor it and keep it topped up to prevent it, uh, myself from falling, I guess. It should be good for now. Come on. Where am I not? Go. It is definitely going to take a while to learn how to do this right. Let me place another one of these just in case. Man, this is so cool. Uh, hold X to... Uh, I already placed one. I guess I'm gonna have to grab that one then. And place one over here. There we go. And jump. Oh, God. And jump. The thing is, I'm getting super tired here. So I gotta hurry up. Oh, you can also rest. Ah. Oh, God. Fine, we're good. We made it. Man, this is not gonna be an easy game, as easy as you guys thought. We are, of course, doing a lot of climbing here, but... It is not just as easy as hitting A and simply jumping up. It actually takes quite a bit of skill. Uh, I cannot really go through there. Let me climb through here. This is such a chill game. Super relaxing. Super enjoyable. Alright. Uh, oh, what do we got here? Oh, we're gonna get a little bit of lore as well. Awesome. Another sleep turning over stones at the old Delta. Harvest. Two delayed stations for parts. A good catch. That could be enough to reopen the route to the old Cape. Otherwise, smooth sailing. A couple old lanterns I think I can revive. Uh, folks used to throw this stuff away. Uh, and I finally caught an old knitting machine for Ineo, who's been asking for one of cycles. Not in great shape though, but we should be able to tinker with it. To tinker with it. Still not sure how I'm going to hold it up uh, on low tide. Hmm. I'm also gonna love finding all the uh, lore parts we're gonna be able to read around here. 
Alright, this kind of looks like we're going to have to do a little bit of jumping as well. Uh, hold, place, a main carabiner. Yep. Oh, God. Okay, so you can actually hold on the carabiner. Not bad. Hold down RB. LB. RB. Ah, that's how you do it. So you can actually go a little bit down. And then... We can, of course, swing. That is so cool. That is so cool. Here we go. That is super cool. Uh, I think I could have went a little bit lower, to be honest. It does like we could go a little bit lower. Can I? So if I try to go down here... Cannot go back down by the looks of it. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like once you reach a top, you cannot go back down. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. So if you miss, uh, for example, if there was like a note over there that I could have read, and if I didn't go down there to read it, that means I can no longer go and pick it up? I don't think I like that. I cannot open up this door. Oh, God. I do not want to fall down there. Oh, what is this? Ah, uh, you can't go down there if you want to. That is so cool. Hold up. Uh, go down. Look at that. That is super awesome. That is super, super awesome. And I actually made my way down here where I wanted to go to. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Really loving this. And it looks like you can even go a little bit lower if you want to. Uh, went on the ground. Wind the rope. I don't want to do that. I want to keep going a little bit lower to see if uh, there's anything around here that I could have collected. Oh, the rope is turning red when it's uh, reaching its limit. I get it now. Look at that. And as I keep on climbing, the color keeps on changing. It's so cool. And if I climb through here, yeah, look at that. The color of the rope gets blue. So that's how you kind of know when you're reaching the limit of the rope. That is super awesome. All right. In that case, let me climb up here. Uh, we do have a note on this side. Or is that like a toy? What is that? Oh, we're gonna have cutscenes. Awesome. When they used to be waters, they used that place, of course, to jump in the water. I get it. So that was kind of like a dock. And people sculpting on this side. Man. This is such a beautiful game. So as we're going to be exploring these crazy mountains, we're actually going to be able to also go through the memories of people, read some lore, and see these awesome cutscenes. Get to hear some sounds, I guess. That is so cool. Alright, let me keep on climbing up then. Pull up. How do we... There we go. <sighs> Yiki, hard things at the sawmill. Business has been slow at the restaurant. Almost no one thinned that last music night. Even though people are climbing down from all over. I know we don't play the shells anymore, but still... I was thinking that adding a scaffolding to the side of the upside down cliff should help steer passerby this way. I miss seeing a packed patio. Can you take care of it? I check with low tide and everyone agrees. Hey Mo, listen, it's going. I hope one day you'll ask me to do something besides taking boats apart uh, to make ladders. Like if I'm free for a romantic dinner or two. <laughs> anyway, sounds good for your scaffolding. Since the village approves, uh, I don't have much wood to choose from. At the new path to the plane, I had to build, but I still have a record to left over. I'll get to it when a current allow. I get to it when a current allow. 
I owe you one. Thanks. You're the best. By the way, do you ever run into old Sonya? I think she's uh, rummaging around in your area right now. If you ever see her, uh, do you mind telling her I need a new uh, hub for my oven? Mine's taking on water. In the meantime, set sail to the restaurant. I'm not sure how romantic it is, but we can always share a half-cooked meal. Man, I cannot wait to explore this game, read all this lore and what everybody did here. That's gonna be super, super cool. All right, uh, add this. And I think I'm supposed to go down. Man, this is so cool. All right, I think what I gotta do, I gotta go all the way to this side and from here, climb up. This is such a beautiful game. And the way you're actually traversing the world, that is super, super special. Uh, hold up, I gotta properly catch onto that. There we go, buddy. All right, add another one. And let's keep it going. Exploring this world is gonna be super special and I cannot wait for this game to come out. I cannot wait. I'm, I've just played like about 15 minutes of the game so far and I'm already in love with it. Whoa, what are those? What are these things? Ah, what the heck? The type of creatures in this world, though. That's super, super cool. Uh, it seems like there is going to be a way to get back down if you want to. I kind of like it when it allows us to... Uh, hello? How do I... It's not allowing me to connect anything here. There we go. Yeah, look at that. If you want to, you can always go back down through here. Just like that. I'm loving this. Alright, but uh, let me keep her going. I don't see any notes here that I gotta read. What are these creatures? Uh, let's keep on climbing through here. Uh, hold to plate a pylon and jump. The reason you're placing those things is just in case you do not catch and uh, you fall down. That way, that thing is gonna catch on you, I guess, and not allow you to take any damage. All right, let me drag the rope back in. Let us see. Is there anything down here? Yeah, I don't know how to. I don't know how to drop down though. Oh. Okay, that was close. That was super close. All right, anyway, let me climb back up. Come on. Keep on climbing. I'm still trying to get used to uh, the whole mechanics here. <sighs> Look at this. Me personally, I've never, never climbed anything, so I'm not quite sure how difficult this is. I gotta guess it's not that easy to do climbing. Especially what this character is doing right now. You need a lot of strength in your arms for sure. Alright. And I think I gotta do a... Uh, press A plus A to perform a double jump. What? I had no clue that is a thing. Hold up, hold up, hold up. So, load. A, A, and... Perfect. That was awesome. Alright, I think I'm going to have to climb onto that in order to swing to the other side. That's what it feels like. Yep, and that's exactly what the game wants me to do. Before I do it though, is there any memory that I gotta find around here? No. Well, in that case... What? Alright, I knew it. I knew that that was going to be a thing. So that's going to allow me to go up. Hold up, buddy. I gotta swing a little bit. And jump. Perfect. Mm -mm. Let me place one of these things. And jump and jump. And jump and jump. Okay, I think we're good to go. Can we climb? No. Now we could climb. 
There we go. The thing is, when you're jumping, you're actually getting tired quite a bit. So you gotta pay attention. I kind of like it that you have the ability to calculate your stamina as well. Placing a secret python allows you to not to fall. I know, I know. Don't worry about it, I'm not gonna fall. But I will place one. Uh, hold up, I think I gotta go this way. Oh god, hold up, I gotta rest. Okay, there we go. Don't worry about it, we got it, buddy. There we go. Awesome. Oh, man. The type of temples these people had inside the mountain. That is so cool. Look at that. I'm guessing I gotta make my way to the other side somehow. Uh, so let me see if that's possible. Oh, man, but this is such a lovely game. And again, as I was saying, this is just a better version. Oh, you know what? I don't think I'm supposed to go in there just yet. I think I'm actually supposed to go inside this tower. Uh, this is just a demo version of the game. This is not the full release. And it's already absolutely stunning. It's kind of like a um, lighthouse. Gotta find a way to climb up. And it looks like the only way is gonna be... I mean, there should be a way here, but it looks like it's destroyed. Uh, let me take the stairs. I'm gonna try to, take, uh, to get all the way to the top of this building. If it's possible. I'm guessing you're also going to be able to get to that side eventually, if you want to. Uh-huh. Maybe I gotta pull that thing down, the bridge? Certainly feels like it. Man, but the type of creatures that we're seeing right here, that's so funny. The creature that I have in my backpack doesn't seem to want to come out. Seems to just want to sit in there. Uh, let me get this down. Man, so we're using uh, a rope, not just to climb, but also to solve some puzzles as well. I'm finally leaving. I'm so happy I didn't sleep a wink. At the old harbor master office, a note caught my eye. It sounded like poetry, expedition to the clouds, seeking hope in water. Join us at 12 octaves. Back in Arl's farm. Highlight to journey together. After spending so long marinating and trying to find meaning in life, It'll do me good to see the world, as Emma would say. Hopefully, we'll be stopping by her hut. Just the thought of seeing her again is enough to tell me that I'm making the right decision. With any luck, there'll be other adventures living from low time. I don't want to make my way to the uh, meeting point with the rest of the expedition all by, uh, all by myself. The one time I ever left here was the Harvest Festival, when I was just a small fry. So an expedition like this is no small matter. They want to set sail on the clouds. Oh no, my parents. I forgot about them. What am I going to tell them? Hey folks, I'm off on an adventure. See you around if uh, and only if I make it back alive. Of course, Bianca dear. Don't forget to bring snacks. Hmm, I better not say anything. And I should bring snacks. What else? What do people normally take on uh, trips like this? One thing's for sure. What's the journey without a logbook? I've got it covered. I plan to make like the expeditions uh, that set off to the salt plain in search of springs. I'm going to scatter my journal or entries along the way for anyone who might come across them. Signing with this message. Farewell, my lighthouse. You welcomed me with wonder and kept me company as I pondered too much. And to watch over this message, I'm leaving one to my creation. Adventure calls, Bianca. Man. I'm going to be guessing uh, all the notes I'm probably going to be finding are going to be from Bianca. Maybe other characters as well. Maybe not just Bianca. Um, but the thing is, i got to keep on climbing. And I really don't see a way. Oh, you know what? I think i got to go through here. 
Okay. Uh, I don't know how to climb up here, though. Oh, I think I see it. I think I see it. Yeah. I think it's on this side that I just opened up. What are you doing? You gotta, you gotta climb up. There we go. Okay, let's go on the side. Man, this is such a wonderful game. The exploration part of it, absolutely amazing. I love what I've done here. Super, super awesome for sure. Uh, hold to place a python. Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I think what I gotta do is go lower. Because I am gonna have to bounce to the other side. And jump. Alright. Get my stuff back. And place it in here instead. Uh, how do we even... Oh, God. Well, that didn't work. Hmm. How do we even do this? I think what I gotta do... Hold up. Oh, I threw it up there. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this. Alright, let me climb up then. That was awesome. As I was saying, exploration in this game is absolutely amazing. I really, really enjoy it so far. We just barely started playing the game. This is just a demo, and I'm already finding it super, super awesome. I cannot wait for the game to come out. Uh, let me place one of these. And jump! Perfect. I also want to know the name of my character as well. I really want to know her name. Uh, place another one and jump. All right, made it. Awesome. All right, uh, we just have a set of stairs here, but I think I'm gonna be able to also find more memories in here and stuff, letters, notes, right? Or maybe not. Never mind. Oh, it is something. Hold up. I asked Mo for help, but it's no use. The door won't budge. There's no way of knowing how its inner mechanisms work. Does it have anything to do with the lost ocean? Mo isn't much of a handyman either, but you'd think we wouldn't been able to figure it out between the two of us. We had to wait anchor A, date, and he said it's true that he did seem rather dressed up to uh, tinker around, rather uh, run to Parfum too. None of this answers my questions. I've explored you from deck to hold, and I'm no further along than uh, I saw it. I still don't know what you could have been uh, used for, my lighthouse. Your painting seemed to allude to water falling from the sky, but uh, that's pretty vague. Now, what am I supposed to do? Hey, we made it to the top! What is this? Whoa. Oh man, this game is gonna be much, much more than just climbing mountains. It is going to be such a special adventure. And look at that. The tiny one is finally waking up. Hey, little guy. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? Look at this little guy that we have. Oh, he's so adorable. <laughs> it's just a blob, I know, but <laughs> it looks awesome. Whoa. What? This is gonna be kind of like a portal that I'm gonna be able to use. Oh, okay, so I guess that's one out of five. If I activate all of them, probably then the portal, the main portal is gonna activate somewhere. So I'm gonna have to do quite a bit of climbing in order to find all of these towers, turn them all on, uh, eventually to turn on the main one. I think that's what it works. And look at that. This kind of gave a little bit of uh, grass around. Which means we probably activated like a little bit of water or something. 
Oh, man, this is going to be such a special adventure, guys. But there you have it. This has been a quick demo of Jusson. Uh, I hope I pronounced it right. This is going to be a very, very special adventure. Jusson in English means downstream, I think. Uh, it kind of looks like the entire oceans, all the water has disappeared. And uh, we're just about to explore the underwater area maybe like the underwater area without the water of course uh and this is gonna be a very very special one but anyway guys that being said thank you all very much for watching if you enjoyed this you know what you gotta do as always like share this with your friends and i'll see you all next time soon bye